Hi, Kevin. Um, congratulations on reaching the postseason. Nick said the team were quite disappointed with tonight, but what does it say about the team's growth that you are disappointed with a result like this tonight? Yeah, obviously coming from last season where we didn't make the postseason, I think big picture, it's a positive that we're over the line and avoiding the the playing game. But the disappointment comes from feeling like we should earn a result here and, you know, just having a desire to take momentum into the playoff run off the back of off the back of a three win week. So, yeah, it's frustrating. I think we didn't perform to our standard and we have to sit with this one, but also try to erase it from our minds quickly and, and focus on Cincinnati. Scott? Hey, Gavin, how are you? Scott Church from Stream Punk Soccer. Uh, to piggyback a little bit off that, when it comes to Cincinnati, uh, the odds were originally going to be that you might be facing like team like, say, Orlando. How do you look at Cincinnati when it comes to the playoffs, or does it even matter in your case what team you're facing? Thanks. Yeah, I think we've played Cincinnati a lot this year and last year as well. We we have had the extra games in Open Cup and Leagues Cup, so we know what they're about. You know, we we put in a good performance against them just uh just a little over a week ago, and we feel confident with that matchup. And I mean, honestly, anyone we play, where we feel confident that we can we can get a result with. So the focus this week will be all about uh, prepping for for Cincinnati and and going on the road to to take three points. Michael Andrew. Hey, Kevin, thanks for the time. Uh, I want to ask you to um, about something that Nick said just uh, earlier tonight. Mm -hmm. He said that uh, he takes um, responsibility every time the team loses a game. Uh, do you feel like, you know, in a way he's shielding you guys from uh, from accountability or do you guys, uh, you know, hold yourselves accountable being that you're on the field and he's not? Yeah, part of being a team is everyone taking accountability. So all 11 of us on the field take responsibility for for the product we put out there. And, you know, I think, I think Nick is uh, doing the same if that's what he said in his, in his presser. So everyone, everyone owns their share of, of the results on the field, uh, players and staff alike. So yeah, of course it's, it's disappointing and we just have to live with it and learn from it. And, you know, we uh, are, our only focus now is just towards Cincinnati. Cushion. One other thing, Kevin, that Nick touched on was this team's ability to produce a response. Uh, probably most recently, the Red Bulls game springs to mind. How helpful is that to you as you approach this week and and all head back to the training pitch? Sure, we can we can take you know light from the recent uh, run of form that we that we came in into this game with. Like we dropped points against Philly in a in a really tough result at home, but then we we responded with ten points out of out of four matches. So. We need to have a short memory and move on to the next one because we know that we can produce a really good run of form off the back of a loss like we've shown this year. Great. Thank you, everybody.